In a confidential report leaked to the press by the magazine Spiegel, officials at the German Federal Office of Criminal Investigation say that the threat of right-wing terrorists remains high in the country. The police also warns of the possible formation of previously unknown right-wing terrorist groups. It's a good thing that the German officials start to talk about the threat of right-wing terrorism in this country. And uh, it's a shame to see how um, the agencies and um, the police has, has uh, handled uh, that problem for the last decade. In my opinion, German politics, in all colors, ignore the fact of fascism from the right. They are blind on their right eye. They look too much to the left and they try to ignore the right wing extremism. But this is really just the tip of the iceberg. I think what we really should talk about is the daily threat that we have regions in Germany, and this is an open secret, nobody denies it, where it is very dangerous for foreigners to live, to even go there for a visit. One year after the discovery of a right wing terrorist cell, the National Socialist Underground, which murdered nine immigrants during a decade-long killing spree, Germany will reform its intelligence services after the scandal of the destruction of secret documents related to the investigation of this neo-Nazi cell. There has been files which have been erated, um, uh, but not all of them. We just hope that we can find out what exactly happened and how the official um, agencies in this country has been involved with that. They, they said, you know, you can read it in reports that, uh, that official agencies wrote down those murderers can't be Germans because murdering is not nothing German, so they have to be something Oriental. This is racism, pure racism, and this is a shame for this country. The media interest is now very high. I think that uh, right now it is uh, really impossible that something uh, gets covered up without uh, being found out by the media. So they really take a strong interest in the whole story. And whenever something is new, it will come up in the media and it will be reported. The confidential report of the Federal Office of Criminal Investigation also notes that in addition to the National Socialist Underground cell, there are two other current investigations into groups suspected of establishing right-wing terrorist organizations. And this time the violence may not be directed exclusively at foreigners or immigrants, but also at politicians, public personalities and police officers. Jewish institutions are also under threat. The Jewish community in Germany has to be very much on alert. I think that there is an opportunity for physical threats, definitely. And I mean, all Jewish institutions are being covered by police, but still, we have to be alert because the fact is today, anti-Semitism and right-wing extremism is something that is done already in public. That you hear all of a sudden that there's a threat against Jewish institutions and Jewish politicians. Current police investigations have verified concerns that the right-wing terrorists have open access to weapons and munitions. Why they're so active? Um, I think because for the last decades they, they had the chance, they, they had the opportunity, they had a lot of space to, to develop their, their ideas and in their organization, so they, it, was a, it was an easy job for them. Where were the security forces? The security agencies in this country observed them and uh, in some uh, several issues they paid people who were working with them. People want to know what happened there and people just want to know how, come that, how it comes that uh, the German officials never could find out what is going on there and that they at least ignored that there has been a right-wing um, terrorism in this country. The German Minister of the Interior, Hans-Peter Friedrich, has said he's committed to monitor the security agencies and to make whatever change is necessary without any taboo or self-restraint. This is Wilson Ruiz for Jewish News One in Germany.